All right, back again, Luke here. And today we've got out the old PC Engine Core Graphics 2, and I figured we could put in this game here. Whoosh, Splatterhouse. So, let's pop this in and play some of that. Well, this one is an absolute classic, and I figured this would be a good, good game here to play for the October Halloween gaming. I think you should have at least one Splatterhouse in there somewhere. This is our intro. That's about it. So here we start off with our main character, a bit of uh, Jason Voorhees inspired character. But this is one of those games I think just graphically it's pretty cool. I mean especially for its time, it looks really awesome. And on top of that I think that um, you know the difficulty is still there even after all these years. I hate these bats. <laughs> what is it with games with bats? Like, why the bats? Okay. Stay away. Oh, stop moving. Ah. Okay. Well, that's to be expected, I suppose. But, uh, oh yeah, here we are. Our first uh, boss. I think the kicking method works out really well with this one. Don't usually get hit. You just gotta remember which direction these guys come from. Just keep swinging around left and right. Ooh, getting close there. Kind of hanging a little bit too far on the... Right side, I think. A little bit dangerous there. Oh, yeah, crap. I forgot about that one. <laughs> That's the one thing that this game does. It just kind of... At the end, it throws something out at you. And you're just like, if you don't watch it, you'll die. Castlevania um, also did the same thing. Or Rondo of Blood. Not sure how far we'll get in this one. As it, uh, it, I mean, it still does have that difficulty to it. We'll hope to get far enough. Not sure if we will or not, but. Whee! <laughs> Creatures here, like from the lagoon here. Gotta watch out for these spikes. You time it wrong, and you'll just wind up getting hit and lose your. Oh yeah, this time. Yeah. Too bad you couldn't hit those spikes. That would have been nice. But I think the, the nice part about this is like, is I think if you do get hit, um, you can still pick up your weapon uh, in the water, which is kind of nice. Moving along here. Oh, this boss, yeah. Uh, this is the one where you gotta watch out for like stuff falling from the ceiling at first. Um, oh, that was good timing. And then this chair. I think the best thing to do is just to volley it off the wall. Oh, shoot! I hate this knife. Whoa. I think if you stand here, too, you can just keep these in check. On the picture. Come on. There we go. Oh yeah, and you gotta make sure to stay on this side here. Or else uh, this'll fall on you. 
learn that lesson the first time. <laughs> stage three is kind of cool. Um, you get the shotgun and whatnot, but the stage three end boss is just a bit of a pain if you ask me. Oh yeah, the dogs, I forgot about them. They, uh, whoa. Ah, uh, come on. They I, they normally actually just eat the uh, the bodies there. Oh, got to jump over these ones. Or else that'll take you down to the the depth part there. Remember some of this stuff. Some of it's just like you can remember it. Oh wait, how many do we have? We got one more shot. Maybe it's worth it. Let's keep it. Yeah, if you fall down below, it can be a bit of a pain here. Coming up on our boss. I missed a shot there. Whoa. Come on. There we go. Some cheap shots there. But it works. Because this game, you do have a limited time uh, amount of continues. I think you can only continue like four times or three times or something like that. Yeah, this is just kind of creepy. <laughs> but, um, yeah, and this... But this one's kind of cool. This is one of the ones where the screen actually does move. Oh, jeez, that was dumb. Did I just lose the life? Oh, no, I have to go the bottom way. Ah... Uh... Oh, this is this one sucks. This route is horrible. Ugh. Normally, don't fall down there, but yeah, this is this one's not not good. Get off me! Get off me! Come on! Oh, what? I can't go up there? <sighs> Jeez! That was horrible. Oh no, it's gonna keep me down here for this whole time now. Yeah. Maybe... I don't remember if you have to clear them all in order to be able to go up again. But... It's a... That's a pain. Get up there. I can't, I can't go up yet. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I got the, the monster on the leg there. Yeah, watch out for falling down those, those pits. It's the pits. Boo. I know. Bad jokes, bad jokes. <laughs> I had these things here. This one's not too bad. I think they're ah, the bats again. <laughs> oh yeah, the dual ones. Run it, run it, run it, run it. Oh cool, there's the end of the that one there. Oh yeah, this stage, this part here. One of these ones like pops out. Oh, that's it. Jeez. Kinda... It's a bit of a scare there. I keep popping out. I don't know. If, maybe I should be on the right side of this. Ah. Uh, only one more hit. Now we're gonna... I think there's one more, too. I don't know if we're gonna... I was gonna kind of die there. Let's try this one more time. Try and rush through this a little bit. Three hits, and then they they die there. So.
one more here. There we go. That was the last one. I, th I remember there was only like three of them here. But uh, yeah, this, I think this next boss here, this is gonna be a challenge. If not, probably just losing at this one here. I forgot what you're supposed to do if you if you have to like kill all the oh, kill all the heads or what what you have to do. But he keeps shooting these heads out everywhere. Well. Wow. Oh. I think this is probably where we're gonna wind up dying here. Once we, uh, we go through this life, I think we're just gonna end the video there. But nevertheless, just wanna share with you guys a bit of a look Whoa. at what Splatter House looks like here on the old PC Engine, and I definitely need to get some more practice in on it. It's feeling very rusty with this one. Ah. <laughs> Can't remember how to beat this one, guys. But, uh, yeah. Nevertheless, we'll go and get some more videos up here and uh, continue our Halloween gaming for October. And yeah, I'll see you guys again here soon.